a lightning bolt travels at a speed of 300,000 kilometers per hour, delivering 300 kilovolts of electricity to the ground. In addition to that, the power of the strike heats up the surrounding air to 50,000 degrees Fahrenheit. That's five times hotter than the surface temperature of the sun. Now, imagine all of that power and heat coming down straight into your body. Needless to say, it would hurt. A lot. Let's talk about what specifically would happen if you were to be on the receiving end of a lightning strike. The heat produced by a lightning bolt can give you third degree burns at the bolt's entry point and at its exit point. The damage can be even worse if you're holding a metal object. Doing so increases the likelihood of being struck by lightning in the first place, and the heat and energy from the lightning can superheat any metal you're in contact with and cause severe burns. If you're not instantly killed by a direct strike from lightning, you're not out of the woods yet. When you're having a heart attack, you might be shocked with defibrillators, which use electricity to stabilize your heart's rhythm. A lightning strike also acts as a massive defibrillator, but instead of stabilizing, the intense power disrupts your heart's electrical rhythm and can cause cardiac arrest. In fact, cardiac arrest is a major cause of death for people struck by lightning. One of the most intense effects of a lightning strike occurs within the brain. If the electric current from a lightning bolt enters your skull, the heat of the electric current will literally cook your brain cells. Depending on how bad this is, you could suffer permanent brain damage, slip into a coma, and possibly even die. When lightning strikes, it creates powerful shockwaves. These shockwaves move through your body, disrupting your internal organs. The force of these waves is strong enough to cause your organs to rupture on impact. A lightning strike superheats the surrounding air like an explosion. If your body is sweaty, the water vaporizes and expands so rapidly that it can singe and shred your clothes. This is why lightning strikes have blown people clear out of their shoes, sending them tumbling some distance away. If you are directly hit by a lightning bolt, you might suffer from long-term neurological problems such as learning disabilities, severe headaches, sleep disorders, and seizures. Some victims suffer from permanent Parkinson's-like twitching throughout their lives. Lightning strikes can cause nerve damage that makes the nerves misfire, which the brain reads as pain, and this perceived pain can last decades after the strike. This all sounds awful, and that's because it is. But look on the bright side. Assuming you survive the lightning strike, you may have a pretty amazing scar to show for it. When lightning makes contact with your skin, it can create lightning bolt shaped marks called Lichtenberg figures. These marks are actually burns which are caused as a result of your blood vessels bursting. So if needles aren't your thing, a lightning tattoo might be your next best option. Actually, now that I've said it out loud, that doesn't seem like much of a bright side at all. Sorry. But look, before you panic, you should know that your odds of getting hit by lightning are 1 in 12,000. And even if you are singled out by Zeus himself and get hit by one, you have a 90% survival chance. Still, while the odds may be in your favor, it's definitely best to simply stay inside and avoid the risk altogether.